What is up guys? It's Bending Stars back with another video. If you didn't see my other one, just click on my channel and go take it right back to my page. So you subscribe and check out my last video. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys my single head bending machine. Well, not really vending machine, but gumball, candy vending machine, ball vending machine. And it's really nice, and I I got this thing for fit for fifteen dollars. Well, I didn't get it; my dad got it for me for my birthday. And it's a really nice gumball machine. The only bad thing is like shaving a little. Of course, when it's in a video, it does not want to do it. And it's kind of a good thing it doesn't want to do it. It would usually just spit out a free gumball, but or gumballs. Because when you put it, it's usually a penny machine, but I use quarters because you still work. And you put one in. Alright, so apparently it doesn't want to spit out free gumballs now. It only wants to spit out one now, so. It's weird. Now I'm just taking another quarter in there just to show you guys that. Oh my god, it's only spitting out one now? I mean, that's a good thing. Okay, that's actually pretty good. So now I know if I want to, I could probably put this one on location if I ever do. Spin out one gumball. No free ones. Wait. Alright, that's cool. And. Yeah, and I'm going to show you how to get the money out of these old gumball machines. And how to fill them up. So. Yep, and we'll be there in three, two. Okay, guys, now I'm going to show you guys how to get the money out of this machine. And I'm going to show you guys. Well, that's about it. Yeah, that's what I'm going to show you guys, how to get the money out of an old machine. All right, so what you guys know is with a gumball machine or a candy machine, you have keys, and there's a little lock at the top where this is and on this one there's not a lock it's like a little screw and i didn't know if you could see that just now but so you take you take like a quarter or a penny and you put it on the top and just start unscrewing it if this thing will pull unscrew. this thing up last time. Oh, wow. Okay, guys. One second. I'll be right back when I get it. It does not want to come off for some reason. But this could still work. Alright, so what you guys want to do, you want to the top. Instead of, like, taking the whole thing off, and this, then this thing off. What you gotta do is, you just pull it up. And there you go. And I kind of see why I did not want to come loose. Okay, so there it is. Then you got all your money right here. And your whole thing is still in one piece. So then you set the head. Got all your money. And one second, guys. You get a little container. And when you're done, there's this little piece right here. It has to line up with this piece right here. And then you just screw it. That's when you set it up. Shove it like that. And you screw this in not as tight. Not 
have to have a screwdriver. Okay, you know what? I'll get back to you guys when it actually starts working. And when I get it all screwed on back together. So, let's get back together. And now I'm going to show you guys what the whole machine looks like. 